today it's going to be this very beautiful summery fun bright look if you wanted to see how I create this look keep watching Okay, I already apply my Too Faced Shadow Insurance all over my eyelid and now I'm gonna use my Milk Jumbo Pencil and I put it all over the eyelid and kind of blend with my fingers. I'm gonna use this 17 very bright yellow eyeshadow. This is just a little bit with the sheen it's not sparkly shimmery just a little bit with the sheen but also if you don't have it that you can definitely use rocket yellow pigment by mac and i'm gonna apply that with e55 all over my eyelid i love this yellow eyeshadow it's amazing Next is Free to Be, which is very, very beautiful pinkish coralish eyeshadow, and it's completely matte eyeshadow. And I'm gonna place that on my outer corner and just a little bit blend with the yellowish eyeshadow. I love how this looks. Put it like this and just a little bit blend these eyeshadows together to do not have like sharp lines between. Then I'm gonna take some small blending brush or crease brush and kind of go into the crease and lightly blend. Chroma Mill by MAC. I'm sorry because I'm using all MAC eyeshadows, but I really love these eyeshadows. And with E35 blending brush, I'm gonna put that on top of the Free to Be and gently blend it together to do not have like harsh, very harsh lines between. To be gently blended. Next eyeshadow is one of my favorite eyeshadow and it's Post Hastel, which is very very beautiful pinkish deep red eyeshadow. Absolutely love this eyeshadow. This is one of my favorite very bright and matte eyeshadows. And I'm gonna use with E25 brush, which is more like 217 brush by MAC. Put into the tip of the brush and go into the crease and kind of make it more vibrant like this. Next eyeshadow is one of my favorite eyeshadow and Sugar Pill Taco, Tico, which is pure white eyeshadow and it's absolutely one of my favorite highlighting eyeshadow because it's pure white matte eyeshadow and it's so so pigmented and I definitely use this eyeshadow every day in my makeup tutorials or with any everyday makeup because I love when this point right here is so bright, so white. And I also put just a little bit on the highest point of my brow bone. I already fill my brows with Essence Brow Kit. I really, really love this. Stay all the long into the place and works perfectly. Next, which I'm gonna use is this Essence Very Bright Turquoise Eyeliner. And this is in Cool Breeze, 11 Cool Breeze. And I'm gonna put that all over on my dowel, eye, dowel lid or under the eyes. Make it like a line. Okay. 
for more dimension of the eyes I'm gonna use this 17 highlight till reflections I really love this I really don't know where you can find 17 because it's Greek cosmetic store and I think it's not sells online and I'm gonna put that right in the corner this is like teal perfect highlights probably you can see it I already lined my eye with super line carbon gloss L'Oreal liquid line eyeliner and this is not very very special it's just a cat line but definitely if you want to have more summer look definitely you can go with white pencil inside but I will gonna leave like this and uh, what mascara do I want to use lately I'm trying to find perfect mascara for me but it's very hard I think I'm gonna use mega volume color again 24 hours by L'Oreal I love this one it's very very big huge brush but makes the eyelashes so so thick and so beautiful and volumized and for more fun I will gonna use this Ardell um, in the visible blend glamour eyelashes it's so thick and full but I kind of like it this this eyelashes okay this is my done look with the eyelashes it's so summery fun with lots of colors okay let's move on on the face first of all I'm gonna put my bronzer and I will not going to put too much because I already have a little bit darker foundation on my face and I'm gonna use Give Me Sun Mirrorized Skin Finish with Big Sigma F30 brush. I love this product for bronzing my face because it's perfect bronzer, I think, for light people like me. I put a little bit. like this and for today blush definitely we're gonna go with one blush which I love lately a lot but like I said I really don't know where you can buy 17 products but this is 17 blush is natural matte silky blush in pink rose it's super matte very very pinkish uh, coralish Okay, like I said, I'm going to use the Silky Rose blush with my Sigma F40 angle brush. I love this blush. Definitely one of my favorite lately. It's matte but gives very beautiful col col colorish coral. Yeah, <laughs> coral pinkish color on the face. Lovely. I want to put a little bit more, I don't know, but I want to be like rosy cheeks. Okay, that was that and Snow Globe highlighting powder or makeup, no, not makeup, a face oh, beauty powder. Oh my god. Okay, with F05 brush. I love this brush for my highlight powder. I put it right here. You see? Lovely! Especially for the summer. I really, really love that natural summer glow on the skin. My nose, forehead a little bit, my chin. Okay, I put on my lips um, Hippie Cheek NYX Matte, very, very nudish 
orangey type of lipstick and I feel and line my lips with this pinkish deep pink lip liner And on top of that, I'm gonna use strawberry milk. Oh my god, what is wrong with me today? I really. Strawberry milk by NYX, which nudish pink, very lovely color. Put it on my lips. And <clears throat> I just a little go with my finger. And blend just a little bit, and this oh my god, and yes, this is my down look. It's so so with colors, so fun and bright. I hope you like it, if you like it, uh, thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe. And uh, yes, thanks for watching and see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye!